Hi, I'm Dr. Joseph Nemeth. I'm a periodontist in Southfield, Michigan, and I want to talk a little bit about monkeypox and the oral aspects of monkeypox. Now, monkeypox has become a very popular topic these days, and it's becoming more and more widespread. And people don't think of mon monkeypox necessarily of being in the mouth. But people who have monkeypox, 25 to 30 percent, anywhere from a third to a quarter of those individuals also have lesions in the mouth. And those lesions may actually appear, appear as a sore throat. You may not even see them, but frequently they can be seen also. And they are transmissible. Now, it's different from, for instance, COVID. They're not transmissible through the air but they are transmissible from the mouth if someone coughs or sneezes because the droplets, actually, if there are droplets that come out, the droplets can contain the virus and can be transmitted that way and certainly kissing because it really takes contact with the material that contains the monkeypox virus. And this is an individual who has monkeypox lesions under the tongue. This is another monkeypox lesion. And again, we're, it's not terribly common yet, but we're seeing more and more, and it's spreading to the greater population. It was limited primarily to men, but now it's spreading to uh, the general population. Monkeypox generally isn't fatal, fortunately. It runs its course in about two weeks, uh, but it can be pretty uncomfortable, pretty painful, and as you saw on those previous pictures, can be pretty disfiguring. So there can be an oral component to monkeypox, and it can be transmissible via oral fluids. So at any rate, I'm sure we'll have more on monkeypox as more information comes out. In the meantime, keep your mouth healthy. If it's not healthy, you're not healthy healthier mouth, healthier body. He let's hear from you. Questions, comments. Have a good day. Thank you. Restore your smile and your health. Visit drnemeth.com to schedule your appointment today.